Creating electric loads is easy in Homer. To create an electric load, select the load tab in the ribbon and click on the electric one icon. These loads represent the electrical power the system must meet each time step by the power producing components. If you have data already, you can import time series files that contain your measured load data in this box. Many times you will not have the details of the load profile available to you, and you will have to approximate what the load data looks like. Homer provides several options that allow you to quickly approximate your load data. These are called synthetic loads. Synthetic loads are divided into four default profiles, residential, commercial, industrial, and community. We include a blank profile to make it easier to fill in your own daily profile. For this demo, we will select the commercial load profile. Since we are setting up an example project in Boulder, Colorado, we select a peak month of July. Now if we were doing a project in the Southern Hemisphere, for example, maybe in Australia, we might pick a peak month of January. Now we see an overview of the load we just created. This includes a seasonal profile showing our July peak load, and a yearly profile known as a DMAP, which is a visualization of the entire year's electrical load. Starting at midnight January 1st, the time of day is represented on the y-axis and the day of the year is located on the x-axis. By hovering your mouse over any particular point, you can see the specific electrical load at that time step. The load that we start with is called the baseline load. We can see the baseline load statistics here. The scaled annual average is the average kilowatt hours per day for the year. By adjusting the scaled annual average, we can quickly scale this default electrical load profile to match our particular needs. In this example, let's say our building uses half this amount of electricity. We can change our scaled annual average This will effectively cut our electrical load in half for each hour. We can see this by clicking on the plot button. Here we see a time series for the scaled data. We will zoom, focus on a particular part of the year, and we will add the baseline data to the same chart. We can see the baseline data in red is double that of our scaled data. We see that the scaled data retains the shape and statistical characteristics of the baseline data, but differs in that it is half the value of the original baseline data. This is a quick and easy method to model data for your project. As you acquire more information about the actual load you are modeling, you can import hourly or minute load data if it is available. Thank you for watching the Homer Software's training series. We are here to help you. If you are a trial user, please contact us at support at homerenergy.com for more information on how to become a licensed user. We have additional training available for our licensed users. Visit gethomertraining.com to learn more.